Peace, oh please keep your mind at ease. It's obvious. Facebook and Instagram and WhatsApp all went down today. And now what does this mean for you? I mean, here's the thing. If social media is going down and you're getting affected, affected by it in some sort of way, like it's bringing you down, if social media goes down, then you know that's a problem. Like, here's the thing. Social media has been, is such an incredible tool for distraction, okay? Distracting you from what's really going in within, distracting you from your goals, and it, there's just so many different ways that is a distraction, okay? So I just, I just want you to realize this, that if you are getting affected by social media going down, then that's a strong, powerful indicator for you that there's some inner work that needs to be done, that you need to be getting to what really matters, because at the end of the day, social media doesn't really matter. What really matters is your soul, your spirit, that you're, that you're cultivating this, this beautiful spirit, and, and you, can, you can just be by yourself and not have to rely on anything, because, you know, someone's having a bad day, someone's whatever, something happens to someone, then immediately they'll just go straight to the social media because it's an easy, it's an Instagram. It's like like a hit, straight hit of, like a drug, Insta, like Instagram, right? It's an instant hit of dopamine, right? So a lot of people will rush straight to social media if something's not going their way, something's not going as planned. If they're feeling down, they'll, they'll run straight to it to get their gram, their instant gram of instant gratification, okay? So that, that's what social media is. And you really just have to see social media for what it is because it's instant gratification, okay? So if you feel like, you know, you're getting a lot of anxiety and stuff, then get off of it. Like, just completely get off of it and actually nurture the part within you that needs the healing. Like, you don't need to be on social media. If you're if you're feeling like anxious, anxious or whatever, you know, you're getting upset over something, these are sure for, these are these are powerful triggers for you to realize that you really got to go within like straight up meditate like how would you feel are you okay with social media going down like that not it's not all social media it's just facebook instagram and whatsapp right but how would you feel if it went down for a week like would you be okay like what if tiktok went down too for a week whatever like would you be okay like how would you feel like would you you'd be getting more anxious and like you wouldn't even know where, where to distract yourself with is that how you would feel you have to really think about that like just take a moment and think about that because a lot of people are just getting pulled away from their inner self their true inner self they're getting pulled away from source like there's times if I'm not like meditating like too often like or something like that, you know, I take a little spaces, little little breaks uh, away from meditation, or I just meditate a little bit less. And sometimes what happens is I feel like a sort of like I'll feel like a sort of emptiness within, right? And I know instantly like that emptiness, that emptiness that I feel I would feel sometimes is that's what other people feel. But when they, when they would feel that, you know, they, they would be going straight to the, the different kind of distractions, you know, TV, you got your social media, you got this and that, like electronics, video games, like, but no, that's, it's a band-aid. That's a straight up band-aid. Like the, me the meditation is the thing that's the more long-term healing, you know, the, the, the actual, the actual source of what the disturbance is. So, Go ahead and meditate. Like, take this as a sign for yourself. Facebook and Instagram, WhatsApp going down. Take this as a sign to meditate today. Okay, meditate today because, hey, distractions—they're not—they're not the things that are gonna take you far, right? Your inner self connection with your intuition, connection with your soul, because this is where you really find your purpose. You really come down to your true self. That's where you find your true self. Just going within, meditating, connecting with your intuition is one of the most incredible things that you can do for yourself. Like, please, connecting with your intuition is one of the most powerful things that you can do for yourself. Because listen, if someone's feeling down, whatever, then instead of following their intuition, they might jump onto the next thing, right? They're trying to, but it's like, Dude, they just missed this opportunity to go straight in, straight into the intuition. They missed the opportunity to go in because they had the distraction. So it's a blessing that Facebook and Instagram went down today to remind you. Hopefully this is a reminder for you to go within, to meditate and connect with your, connect the source, 
connect with your intuition because that's one of the most powerful tools, most powerful things that you have that's gonna pull you forward and bring you to your highest self, your highest, your, the best version of you, please. Peace, oh please, keep your mind at ease. It's off.